I hope my memory does not fail me. Dreams seem to slip away so quickly. I hope you can see what I have seen. This dream has aged and has probably changed. I remember standing alone on an island high up in the sky. Off in the distance, I saw another island. Loud music played there and a smoke rose from the barbecue on the grill. I saw my whole family, I was by myself. A rope connected the islands as a bridge. It reminded me of the tightropes you saw in the circus. My desire to be with my family outweighed my fear of falling. I walked forward uneasily. I was not agile and I had not trained for this. Still, I wobbled forward, surprised that I had made it this far. It got easier until my eyes glanced down. I fell, and my heart rate increased with every inch. I felt my body getting closer to the water. Before my body reached the sea, it turned into my bed. My eyes opened, and I was in my bedroom. I shook, and my chest moved up and down quickly. I retold the dream to myself, hoping to keep it locked in my memory. I am sure there is a metaphor to take from it. I leave it to you to make an interpretation. I always come back to this dream and replay it. Maybe I'm remembering it wrong. Psychologists have found memories are not reliable. My imaginative thoughts will keep me up at night if I am not careful. But since I am thinking about it, I have a question. Why did the falling feel so real? It did not feel imaginary. That I know for sure was not illustrated by age memory. Can you trick your senses so a man believes he is falling? Can your mind trick your nose so it believes it smells meat on a grill? Perhaps our minds are the great deceivers. I wonder if my memory has lied about anything else. The sure thing we can count on is the present. The present has not had the chance to be tampered with.